back to Dolphin's Kitchen. In today's video, we're going to be preparing chicken peanut soup in Katsim Kwang. Um, that's um, the, Ghanaian, the Ghanaian name of peanut soup. It's uh, in Katsim Kwang. Uh, I'm going to be using chicken. My, I've got my chicken here, my hard chicken. I have washed them in um, in lemon and vinegar really well and I've got a medium sized onion chopped in there and I have my two tins of tomatoes which I'm going to be blending and here I have my scot bonnets, my ginger, my garlic and my onions and I've ha I have here my um, peanut paste this is the smooth one and I've got my all seasoning, all purpose seasoning and I've got my tomato puree here, about two tablespoons and I've got my anise seeds here, I'm going to be blending with these, these lot to be steaming the chicken and I have my, uh, my salt to taste. Anyway, let's get cooking guys. Okay guys, here. Here is our blended stuff to steam our chicken. I'll just rinse the pot, the um, blender a little bit. Right, rinse the blender. And I'll be adding about a tablespoon of my all-purpose seasoning. And my salt to taste. I'll add about a tablespoon as well and we'll leave this to simmer for about 20 minutes and we just keep an eye on it whilst it's going okay guys also guys um i decided to add my chicken this is kip mix that's in dutch a kip is um it means um, chicken in English. Um, this is my chicken seasoning. I just add a tablespoon of that one to to give it more flavors. Okay, leave it to simmer for twenty minutes and keep an eye on it. Okay, guys. And um, whilst we are waiting on our chicken, uh, I want to get my my peanut paste ready. And when I'm doing the chicken peanut soup, what I tend to do is I always like to blend my tomatoes. My tomatoes, I blend my tomatoes together with my peanut paste and hot, with hot water and um, that's what I usually do. And I always like to use hot water when blending it because it makes it easy. It doesn't the peanut paste doesn't stick in the blender. It makes it very easy. So and that will be ready. We'll be all ready for the um for when the chicken is ready. So I'm gonna be blending this now. So you see, my paste is all ready. It's all blended nicely. Waiting for the chicken when it's done. So this has got our tomatoes already, so we don't need to blend it separate, the tomatoes. All right, this is all ready. Waiting for our chicken. So we're gonna set this aside. Okay guys, let's check on our chicken. It's been on the fire for about 25 minutes now. It's looking good. And the smell, oh my God. The aroma is beautiful. It's wonderful. Right, at this point we can add in our tomato, our tomato puree, and goes there. And 
We can add in our, our peanut paste mix as well. Our peanut paste. We'll rinse our pot. And now add in some hot water because I don't want I don't like my peanuts soup thick. So it's all up to you how thick you want your your soup. But well, my peanut soup I really don't want it thick at all. So this is the consistency I like mine. See? And it's gonna thicken anyway whilst it's whilst it's cooking. It's gonna thicken. So we're gonna leave this again for another 20 minutes. I will keep an eye on it because it can be really messy when you fully cover it. So we're gonna be we're gonna cover it halfway and leave it and keep an eye on it. Here we are guys after 20 minutes. Our soup is still going and it's looking it's looking really nice. We still got a while to go. All this foamy bit needs to disappear before we know that our soup is nearly done. So we've got a while to go. We'll just leave it for another 20 minutes and keep an eye on it okay guys this is on a medium heat okay guys um our soup i gave it an extra 30 minutes um after the 20 minutes i, I, I told you guys before i checked on my soup and it was a bit too thick for me so i had to add a little bit bit more water um about three more cups of water to it to get to this consistency that i want so here we are this is about 30 minutes now and it's is looking good it's nearly cooked so let's give it about 10 more minutes and our soup will be done all right guys so i shall see you in 10 more minutes right guys our soup is ready look at that isn't that beautiful it's looking all yummy anyway guys thank you very much for watching please don't forget to give us a thumbs up and I hope you do try the soup and let me know what you think thank you guys and I shall see you in my next video.